Hello contractors, today I want to show you running the contractor mini CNC mill with uh, software EMC, uh, the Linux uh, CNC uh, application for running uh, CNC machines and some impression, impressions of the software itself. Uh, I installed uh, the last uh, Ubuntu uh, version, that's Ubuntu 10.10. It's a special edition from Linux CNC. Uh, the specialty is uh, that included a real-time application interface. So, if you install this uh, software as uh, permanent on your uh, desktop or as live CD, you get a new uh, menu entry for CNC. The first is that there are a lot of uh, manuals and guides how to uh, configure and uh, to install um, this software and running this software. It's uh, quite actual. You see this from uh, 26 November 2010. So there are a ton lot of tons of information running this software. So, first of all is uh, to get uh, your machine uh, configured. Here is a configuration wizard. I will start it and before I have done uh, some installation so uh, therefore I am choosing modifying existing configuration and you see I uh, named it Contraptor Mini CNC. So, these are the settings, this uh, machine name you can choose as you like. This uh, is installation directory. The Contraptor Mini CNC is a 4 axis um, CNC machine. I'm running it in millimeter, you can choose inch like you want. Uh, we are using uh, the RipRap uh, stepper uh, board, uh, this is using L297. A controller. This is address for parallel port and here I have some settings. Um, these are special uh, settings uh, for uh, depending on the latency uh, of your uh, PC you can evaluate these uh, values uh, running here this test uh, base period uh, jitter. So, on this screen I made the settings uh, for running uh, the Contraptor Mini CNC with the parallel board adapter I, um, I did and I will uh, show you in the forums uh, thread. Uh, the meaning is there is a parallel port for example pin 2 and uh, this is um, connected uh, for the X direction pin 3 is connected to X step and so on and so on. Uh, there are some unused pins, one pin for enabling uh, the machine and this very nice uh, some settings for uh, the limit switches for minimum maximum. What you can also do here is uh, choosing is a, as a home position but this is something I am sti still uh, experiencing and uh, it's not finished uh, here at this time. So, I will continue and we get the first panel uh, for uh, conf configuring the x-axis. Uh, here you can see uh, some values, um, you maybe you have done uh, while uh, configuring uh, the CNC mill uh, with uh, Arduino board. These are steps per revolution, uh, micro-stepping, this is a transmission between a motor and lead screw, in our case it's one to one. Uh, maximum velocity, maximum acceleration, you can uh, change it while testing this axis, I will uh, show you uh, after. So here are uh, some uh, values uh, for the measurement, measurements of your uh, construction and now I will start to test uh, the x-axis. You can see you can jog it in both directions. You can adjust uh, the acceleration and find uh, that value 
which is good for your machine, your uh, velocity. I tried with, and you see, see the machine, the machine is stalling, so I have to re reduce this value, and this seven millimeters per second uh, seems to fit. What you also can do is uh, do automatic uh, running. So here I will uh, set ten and a half uh, millimeter in each uh, direction, and after. Uh, this test you can measure whether you lost some steps or not if you stop uh, this mode machine will return to that point where you started this you can do for all three axes this is the y axis just short demonstration here plus direction minus direction this uh, values uh, all right also same for the z-axis, up and down, and also the running mode, very short uh, movements, it looks funny. Okay, in the next panel you can include uh, some uh, special uh, panels you can uh, create by your own. These are good uh, for controlling the, the signals, but I jump over it here now. Okay, after applying this, there are new icons on your desktop. One is a uh, shortcut to the folder where uh, the uh, settings are situated, and another one for accessing uh, the machine with that uh, settings uh, we have uh, experienced in the tests uh, before. So, uh, just just for short explanation what you are seeing here, this is the main screen, you can see at uh, your uh, G-code file from uh, different uh, perspectives. I like this one very much. You can turn this as you like, you can zoom in and out, move it left, right, up, down and down here is uh, the g-code file for this here you can uh, choose some uh, settings for jogging setting maximum velocity and so on here is an emergency button here is on off button for the machine and here you have the same as uh, uh, possibilities as before in testing uh, the settings you can move and around finding a zero point and homing point for this axis I uh, put it here do the same with the next axis and say okay this is now my homing for that axis and of course uh, for that also and afterwards you can uh, run this code this will give an error because this uh, measurement is too big for my machine so i expect to get uh, an error now okay there's a hint that this uh, program exceeds the minimum of the of the x axis and the z axis i say run anyway and it's not possible because it's uh, too big Okay, I guess you got a short impression about the power of this uh, software. I like it very much and I will continue using it and uh, I wish you a lot of uh, fun in running your mini CNC. Thanks for watching, bye bye.